Chip Roy fiercely criticized Attorney General Merrick Garland and the Biden administration for their mishandling of immigration laws, especially in light of the heartbreaking cases of teens Lisbeth Medina and Lachin Riley, who were allegedly killed by illegal immigrants. We, the people of Texas, money's not going to solve the problem when the Department of Homeland Security and the President of the United States refuse to enforce the law, ignore the policies, and Lizbeth Medina would be here alive today if we were following the law. Lake and Riley would be here today if we had not released a killer under the streets of the United States of America through parole policies that this administration is advancing. And the Department of Justice is suing the state of Texas in court, taking valuable resources to go against the people of Texas when Texas simply wants to say, that we should have a say in stopping people who are illegally, arrest them, and be able to deal with that on our own terms when the federal government refuses to do its job. As, in reflected, terms of in our, as reflected in our uh, filings in that case, we are in court because the United States Supreme Court in Arizona versus the United States held that states cannot you're, adopt their own immigration. You're in, you're in court because you're choosing to try to stop Texas from enforcing the laws that the choice. federal government is refusing to enforce. And by the way, that's not the same thing as Arizona. Roy's call for stringent law enforcement and robust legal frameworks on immigration mirrors, the public's cry for stronger border security and a more aggressive stance on illegal immigration. By highlighting these individual tragedies, Roy aims to humanize the dire consequences of what he views as policy failures, aligning with conservative values that emphasize safety and security. This clash between state and federal authorities is a critical issue, particularly in the realm of immigration, traditionally overseen by the federal government. As Roy articulated, Texas's actions underscore a claim to state sovereignty in response to federal actions. The Justice Department's lawsuit against Texas, aiming to enforce immigration laws locally, is perceived as federal overreach, undermining the state's efforts to safeguard its citizens.